All over the world and throughout history, women have been and still are subjected to oppression, mutilation, slavery, and murder with no consequences to those who inflict the suffering and mistreatment. Some cultures view women as less than human. Based on my research, I have learned that women are treated as possessions in many cultures. In some cultures, they undergo types of mutilation, such as female circumcision and many other horrific things. Today, I will persuade you that women are still often oppressed and mistreated due to their gender. Throughout history, there are many people and cultures that have suffered oppression but none so consistently as women. Since the rise of patriarchal societies, when women have been seen as inferior to men. Women have had no rights in society throughout history and were often seen as possessions. Women were often denied an education, making them easier to oppress. According to Fratelli in Women's Rights, People's Human Rights, in the Journal of Sociology and Social Welfare, gender-based violence constitutes a major public health risk and is a serious violation of basic human rights throughout the world. Oppression of women is often woven into the fabric of culture. Religion often places women in an inferior and submissive Even the Bible says, let the women learn in silence, with all subjection. But suffer not a woman to teach, nor to usurp authority over the man, but to be in silence. For Adam was first born, then Eve. And Adam was not deceived, but the woman being deceived was in the transgression. That's Timothy 2, 11, 14. Women are often denied the right to own land, making them dependent on a man. Um, throughout history and in other countries still today. Um, also, women have been denied a voice in government so that they cannot stand up for their rights. According to Steven Pinker, in many places, female fetuses are selectively aborted, newborn girls are killed, daughters are malnourished and kept from school, young women are clubbed from head to toe, adulteresses are stoned to death, and women are expected to fall onto their husband's funeral pipes. Viewing women as less than human leads to horrendous acts. In some cultures, women are required to undergo female circumcision to take away their desires and therefore make them easier to control. Women and girls are sold into sex slavery. In other cultures, women can be killed if they have brought any type of dishonor to the family, such as wanting an education. According to the Human Rights Watch, Despite great strides made by the international women's rights movement over many years, women and girls around the world are still married as children or trafficked into forced labor or sex slavery. They are refused access to education and political participation. And some are trapped in conflicts where rape is perpetrated as a weapon of war. Without an education, Women are denied the right to raise the status and situation of herself and her children. She must remain reliant on another man. According to David Kennedy in the Brief American Pageant, until the 19th century in America, women could be legally beaten by her overlord with a reasonable instrument. That wasn't very long ago. Although the plight of women in many cultures is very dire, 
There is hope for improving the situation. Throughout history, there may be endless examples of the mistreatment of women, and even still today in many societies. This is because of religion or sociological factors or political factors or many other reasons. But it is very important to educate people about what has happened and what is still going on in many parts of the world. Because if people are educated, then we can start to change things around the world for the better for women and just people in general.